Hey, what's up you guys? What's going on? This is Flash and thanks for tuning in to my very first video that I'm putting up on this channel. Uh, excuse the mic quality and the camera quality. I resorted to doing this on my laptop for the very first time just because I had the time to do it now, so bear with me. Um, so, this first video is going to be a little bit just to get to know me. For those of you who already know me, you might learn something new about me, maybe not. We'll find out. So I guess one of the first things I should start off with is the number one misconception about my life, bruh. Uh, Y'all might think I'm white, newsflash motherfuckers, no. I'm Brazilian. My mom and my dad were born and raised in Goiânia in a state called Goiás in Brazil. It's a couple miles away from the district capital, which is right dead center in the entire country. Um, so yeah i am brazilian uh i speak portuguese fluently i also speak spanish fluently i know a little bit of french and a little bit of arabic so I'm trying to develop a little bit more on that but yeah so i was born in san francisco i was raised in the bay area uh whether that was in oakland or san francisco or burlingame or concord or a lot of other places including berkeley and stuff like that but yeah so i've been all over the bay area throughout the course of my life my dad works uh and worked at the time with real estate so we would always bounce around and also my mom then being divorced i would always bounce around both houses so there's that so another thing about me is that i work with music i graduated earlier this year with a bachelor's degree in the applied sciences of sound arts which pretty much is a fancy ass word for sound engineer <laughs> So yeah, uh, I lightweight produce, not up to my standards yet, but I know how to produce. I mix, I master, I record, um, I also know how to rap, I also make my own like original content. Not a lot has made it to the internet yet, but we're working on it, just wait on it. Another thing about me is I am 22 years old, about to be 23 in February. I am married um, for almost two years now to my lovely, lovely wife, Victoria. Uh, we have two dogs. Uh, Milo is a Chihuahua. Lucky is a Pitbull. They're awesome pets. I love them to death. They're my boys. And anybody that knows me knows I treat my dogs like they're my kids. So there's that. <laughs> but um, yeah, and as you can see right now, I'm working in a vapor shop called the Vapor Cave over in San Mateo, California. So we're affiliated with the Cave Smoke Shop, which is one of the biggest glass galleries in the country. So if anybody's in the Bay Area and wants to check out some dope bongs or even some dope vapes, come and holla at your boy. Another thing about me is that I have been working in the marijuana industry for quite a while now. Anybody that knows me personally knows I am actually very well in tune with the marijuana culture and the practices and also the science behind things so i really like to like learn more about that just because i've always been fascinated with thc and cbd and just hemp and cannabis and just the marijuana umbrella in general it is awesome i love the way that the plant actually helps you and on in so many levels and the fact that it's still debated if it's good for you or not is ridiculous but that's besides the point and so with all that being said, the last bit of information I want to cover is going to be one of the more important ones in my opinion and one of the more personal ones in my opinion and maybe one that might shock a lot of people and a lot of people might not be surprised at all, but that's besides the point. So the last thing is I actually wanted to talk to you guys about is that I actually identify as transgender. So what that means is I identify as a male even though I was assigned a female at birth. So with hormone replacement therapy and surgery, I'm going to be able to transform myself into as close as possible to a biological man as I can with the with the available options that are out there. So uh, I know I'm gonna be bombarded with questions because of that stuff, but don't worry, I'm gonna be updating a lot of the stuff that I'm gonna be doing on here. And I'm also going to be answering questions on my Instagram or even on my uh, YouTube comments or whatever it may be. But feel free to reach out. I'm not really shy about any of this. So if you guys want to ask me any questions, feel free. Um, the number one question I already know you motherfuckers are going to ask is, uh, are you going to get the surgery? Um, to be quite honest with you, y'all ain't got to know all that shit. The only surgery you guys do got to know about <laughs> is going to be my top surgery, which is very, very, very much needed for me personally. It's one of the things that definitely bother me the most besides my voice. <laughs> but yeah, so in case you guys didn't know, I, Benjamin Pinero, identify as a transgender man. And yeah, so this is my coming out video. <laughs> It's a little weird for a lot of people, but uh, even for me, for that matter, because I never thought that this is how things would go. Um, 
but yeah so being a little bit vulnerable right now but i hope that this can actually either you know open up doors for people who are in the same situation as me or at least how i was before and not being able to talk about it or feel like i was completely alone and on top of that i also just want to be somewhat of you know just a inspiration for anybody who feels like that they need that extra oomph or extra push or somebody on their side to help them do what they need to do to make themselves happy and especially happy within their own skin because I've spent the last 20 year, 22 years completely dreading the skin that I live in and it is what it is people who know me will know that I mean especially the people in football I've actually had a lot of my football coaches ask me whether I identified as trans and whatnot and for obvious reasons in high school I didn't want to come out because I even though I have thick skin I didn't want to deal with that because it was still something very raw for me um but yeah so with everything said today I hope that everybody has a wonderful day thank you so much for watching this video and feel free to comment down below and don't worry about it i am open about any questions you guys might shoot me in private um besides that one question that i'm not gonna answer because i'm not down to do that because uh y'all like i said y'all ain't gotta know that like y'all ain't gotta know that much i already got a wife so nobody gotta be knowing about what's under there so all right you guys and to wrap up this video i just want to say thank you very much for you guys tuning in and watching this video feel free to comment down below i'll answer any questions besides that one question because uh you nosy motherfuckers ain't gotta know every detail of my life but i'll let you guys in into a good amount of it um thank you very much to anybody who is new and watching this and thank you for all my friends and family who are already know me and obviously the <laughs> obviously know me but they are tuning in and actually supporting me and giving me some views and some likes and hopefully some subscribes but yeah so hope you guys have a wonderful day flash sign out